gonna eat it. Okay, we're good. So anyway, how does a potato poison you? I eat potatoes raw all the time, dude. Seriously? Seriously. That is so jacked up, man. So jacked up. I'm just I'm just telling you right now, Devs. I don't know where you guys are from, but potatoes, uncooked potatoes will not make you sick. That's not a thing. Don't make it a thing. What's up, everybody? It's Bloodstalker, and I just had a weird message. A crude spear has been stored in my backpack. That's weird. So anyway, <laughs> what's happening, folks? You guys doing all right? Me? Doing pretty good. Oh, I need some water, though. So do I got any coconuts around here? Uh, I got a propeller. Drinkable, empty drinkable coconut. Let's just get us some of that solar, good solar water. So it's night time. What time is it? I haven't slept. Yep, I'm waiting to sleep. I'm waiting until about 9 o'clock or so. Oh, look at that. Look at all these buckets. It's buckets for days. I can no longer say my bucket is a bucket of... Yeah, you know the rest is empty because they're all full. So I have a whole lot of to give. And you can just fill in the blank with any word you choose. But you kind of get my gist, don't you? So anyway, guys. <laughs> what is up, everybody? I'm having the greatest day of my life. And it's because I am off work. Yes. That's right, folks. Taking advantage of vacation that I've earned. And I feel pretty good about it. So it's like, this is a cook, is this like a cooked potato or something? Just a potato. I'm just going to eat it. Okay, we're good. So anyway. How does a potato poison you? I eat potatoes raw all the time, dude. Seriously? Seriously. That is so jacked up, man. It's so jacked up. I'm just I'm just telling you right now, Devs. I don't know where you guys are from, but potatoes, uncooked potatoes will not make you sick. That's not a thing. Don't make it a thing. All right, anyway. That's my ranting and raving. So yeah, what time is it? I don't want to make sure I get my okay. We're going to try sleeping real quick. Save it. Sleep it. So yeah, I'm off work, man. This is my fr it's Friday, by the way. I don't know when this video is going to come out. I'm trying to get some videos recorded so I can have some time doing some more things. Oh, look at that. So nice. There's our base. Um, we really need a lot of resources, and I need to check and see what I've got in here. Get on. Don't push it out. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I hate that. I really hate that. I always do that crap. I need it tab. Because there's nothing in there. I got it all out. What about you? You got some bandages I'll keep on you. Let's check our inventory because I want to get going like as soon as possible. I'm not going to put any sticks in the fire. It's just silliness right there, guys. Blah, 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 blah. All right. I got a knife. Let's put the hammer down. I'm going to drop the hammer, guys. Calm down. Don't be alarmed. I am going to pick up a bucket of water so we can take with us. And I got four spears. That's it. We can always make another one out there in the out there in the wild. Oh, I don't know why I just did that. Let's do this first. Then we'll go to that. Then we'll go to this. We'll go to that. We'll put that there. Yeah, there we go. All right, folks. We're gonna interact to sail. We're gonna go around the island this time. We're going to go around the island this time. Okay, we're going to push the boat off this time. <laughs> oh, why do you frustrate me? Got a whole jump to get on. Alright, now we're going to sail around the island this time. We're going to go backwards. No, 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 that's forwards. I want to go backwards. Alright. So, yeah, we're going to go do some exploring on the other side. Uh, let's go this way. It's probably easier. Man, this thing is so hard to freaking steer. I really want to get a motor. I'm so jealous of Cage's boat. He's got a motor on his. Cage is just... Cage is a beast at games like this. He just... He really just kills it. I am so lazy at games like that. I mean... I don't know. My gameplay is not as fast-paced as a lot of people. I'm probably like a snail when it comes to like getting anywhere in a game. Let's go. 
But I'm not, Cage is playing on the experimental build, and I thought about doing it, but I'm going to wait. Um, just because I want to, I want to just, I want to experience this, because I haven't played this game in so long. I mean, I've legitimately not played this in a long time. There's been so many updates. I mean, I remember when they did this update that changed the water texture and the look of everything and made it a little bit more intense. So, that's a long time ago, guys. This game's been out for a long time, and it's, it's a great early access game that's getting a lot of work. So anyway, we are off on our own expedition. Now, everybody, we talked about the lost thing. A lot of good comments. Draw a map. I need to make a compass. I don't think I can make a compass yet. I don't think I have the tools for it. I know I don't have the resources, but what I figured is omnidirectional. So I know that I went away from my island this way. So wherever I land my boat on the next island, I need to turn around and go back the exact same way. So I'm going to try to map out everything as I go. And I don't see any islands out here. That's kind of weird. There's that one over there, but that's, you know. I don't know. This might be a bad idea, folks. We're going to give it a trot. We're going to give it a shot. So anyway, while we're kind of in between star stuff here, we're going to keep going here. We're going to talk real quick because I've been trying to record a video for Frontier, which is a early access western style game. And Sunset Rangers, which is another early access Western game. And neither one of those damn games are cooperating with me. I legitimately just recorded Frontier. And I died. I was in the middle of mining a, mining a stone node. And bam, dead. I don't know what killed me. I didn't get no death message. It just, you're dead. Respawn. I went to respawn. The game locked up. Feels kind of bad, guys. Feels kind of bad. So, I'm back on Stranded Deep. I was going to record this next anyway. See, today, like I said, it's Friday. I've got a big plan Holy crap, is there not any islands out here, dude? Seriously. Seriously. Is this like the edge of the map? Those are buoys right there. You see them? Tell me this isn't a thing. Is this really a thing? Is, that, did I, is this the world border here? We're going to find out. No? What the... I am so freaking confused. What in the hell is that? Am I gonna like? Am I like? I don't, what's gonna happen to me, man? I just broke the rules, man. I'm hearing the shark music too. Matter of fact, let's do this. I've come to realize on the games that my, <laughs> I think my audio is really loud. It's really not environment sound we'll turn that up just a little bit the squishing noise gets on my nerves but we're not on walking on land I don't know what that's going to sound like in game yeah we're getting that sound that bump dum 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 so anyway I figured we're going to get in here and do this now while we're sailing where to where I don't know I mean I'm kind of alarmed I mean why isn't there anything out here damn it I mean, it could be a good thing, could be a bad thing, because usually there's like, like there's, I know the Cage found a research facility. I don't know if it's in the regular build, but it's in the experimental build, and I really love those things when they had them in there. They're so hard to find, but they're so cool once you found them. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. We're going to keep doing this. So anyway, while we're doing this real quick, I'm going to let you guys in on some information. Um, you know, after the vlog the other day, we had some good discussions about YouTube in general, and YouTube, as of yesterday has made changes to their partnership program. Now what these changes are is basically if you are U currently a YouTube partner and you have less than 10,000 lifetime views, meaning on all your videos, your channel is no longer being monetized. You can no longer monetize it and you will no longer get ad rev. So that's a thing. It's, once you get 10,000 views, lifetime views, you're already a partner, your monetization should kick in. I don't know if they'll re-review you again or not. I'm not sure. However, if you are not a YouTube partner currently and you're interested in becoming one, you cannot apply until you get 10,000 total lifetime views. Holy crap, dude. I am... We're going to keep going. I saved it beforehand, so worst case scenario is I just don't save again and I just start back over there. We're going to take this as an experimental option. I mean, I'm just going to keep going, dude. I'm like thirsty as hell, but, you know, I'm going to keep going. So anyway, so if you were interested, once you get your 10K views, you can apply for partnership. Now, YouTube will review your channel. They won't just automatically approve you. 
they're going to go back through all your stuff. There's another shark. So it's kind of neat in that fact that they're trying to alleviate bad videos, get, video inappropriate videos getting inadvertently getting advertisement put on it. And it's to reassure their advertisers who advertise on Google. So will this bring back the big big advertisers we that YouTube lost and Google lost? I don't know. It's a step in the right direction, though. So a lot of people were pretty upset about it, and I'm like, you got to go back to and like, and Cage could probably talk about this as well, but the, the YouTube process for partnering back in the day was a lot more strenuous and was not as simple as going out there saying, yes, check, I want to monetize my videos. Okay, go here, fill out, create an AdSense account. Go here, read the terms, accept the terms, bam, you're monetized. Your videos are approved. And you start monetizing immediately. And 24 hours later, you get a notification saying that everything's been cleared up and approved and accepted, you're done. It never was like that back in the day. That was something new they'd done, and that's kind of what's created. That's kind of what I alluded to is creating their problems is they just accept anybody. Okay, guys, I'm getting alarmed here. So what I'm probably going to end up doing is just not saving the game and just going back to where we're on our island because I'm just going to keep going for a little bit longer because I want to see if we find anything. This is so damn weird, man. So damn weird. But anyway, so it's a step in the right direction. That's all I'm going to say about that, and then we're going to keep going back into the game. So I'm going to keep sailing for a little bit longer before I, say, before I quit the game. So either we'll pop back up and I might have found something or we're going to pop back up and we're back at base. So <laughs> give me a minute. We'll be right back. Well... <laughs> So by looks of things, you know what happened there. <laughs> yeah, I kept going and going, man, and um, wow. I have no words. I legitimately have no words. We're going to take a bucket of water with us. Oh, it's raining, too. That's good. How much water? Okay. There we go. We're going to grab a fresh bucket <laughs> after I did all that. There we go. Empty drinkable coconut. I'm going to eat a couple of coconuts first because, you know, when we took off, I didn't realize that, but I literally left without eating anything or drinking anything. And so that's why my stats were so low when I looked at them. But yeah, I guess we hit the end of the world border or whatnot. Where did the, damn, that thing went flying, did it? kind of cool though it's, it's different weather this time okay there we go let me eat my coconut now why am I not on here I'm like off in the middle of the raft okay because I'm holding something no because that's just weird I'm not gonna I'm not gonna question that we're gonna move on all right, so this time, I guess we're going to go this way. And it's cloudy, so we're going to really have to do a better job paying attention, navigating our areas here. All right. So anyway, <laughs> yeah, we, I suck. Um, I guess, I really guess we just hit the world border. I, didn't, I thought we were, like, more centrally located than that, but I don't know. I'm going to have to look up the buoy thing. If you guys know what that is, let me know, because I've never seen that in the game. Legitimately, I've never seen it. So we're going to go this way. Uh, let's go more this way. So wherever we go to points us back straight to our island. This is my this is the best trick I can have, and the, what really sucks is island hopping. So what I'm gonna what we're, the, another thing I'm gonna do to help with navigating is. Any island I touch down on from the first the first island I touch down on after leaving mine, I will point. I'll go around and collect some stones and drop a stick and try to make an arrow pointing that way. Or something pointing to that way with like a point tip or something. I don't know. We'll figure something out. But that's what I used to do in the old game. you got to really kind of think cleverly outside the box. And wow, this, this makes for choppy water. Ooh. They've done a really good job on the mechanics of this game and the realism. realism. I'm telling you, man. So I'm going to keep... I can't see any island. There's that one, which I know is my old island. Think yeah, that's the old island. So we're gonna keep going this way. Once I get someplace, I will bring you guys back. Cause traveling on the water just kind of sucks. We'll be right back. 
So like legitimately, we're like right at the back of the map because I started going away from the island. I ran right into buoy. So this is that island right from there. It's freaking crazy. And we've been here. I mean, this is our old island, I believe. I mean, yeah, trees down. So I'm going to chop up a couple of sticks. Oh, give me that. I'm going to get some sticks and make up just a direction so I know that, that my island is this next one over here. Get some more yucca. I mean, it's already respawned. There's my raft over there, matter of factly. The original raft, which sucks a lot. I'm going to carry this in yucca form because I just get more of it. Okay, let's see. All right, let's see if there's anything else we want to take. I mean, we are back over here. I can get some water while I'm over here. That'd be a nice little thing to do. Drinkable coconuts? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can't fill up a... Uh, I could try to fill up a hatchet full of water, but I don't think it's going to happen. We're good on that, so... So yeah, man, it's just... Ooh. Take a couple of these with us. I mean, do I got a stack of four good? So yeah, we got our tanner rack and everything over here. More yucca. So yeah, I'm going to make an um, arrow point to that island. So I guess we just legitimately went to the back of the island, which kind of pisses me off because I didn't realize we were that close to the back. I mean, I wouldn't have built... I wouldn't have tried to, like, relocate to that island. I would have kept looking around, so... I don't know. We still might not... not we might not have found our uh, original island yet, guys. We might not. All right, so I got everything I need. We'll leave this place here because, hell, it's there. I'm going to come over here and put down some stuff. Might as well grab any yucca I can, or plants. I need some stones now. Let's see here. Keep coming over here. So that's our island right there. So we're going to do this. Going to pick up a stick. Here, I'll tell you what we'll use. Well... Wood stick. Really? I hate you sometimes. Okay. Let's pick you back up. Let's do it like this. Okay. There, now I'm getting it. Not really, but hey. We'll figure this out. So I need to drop it right about here. Oh, there we go. We'll come over here. And we'll drop that right about there. I kind of like that positioning a little bit better. Okay, then we'll get... Is that going to work? There we go. That point's right there. We'll put another one, make sure everything's big and clear. Uh, no. Come on, I can do this better, man. I feel like I, feel like I can do this better. There we go. Sweet. So there. We know that that's our island. We all in agreement there? I think we are. Let me pick my hatchet back up. Seriously? Oh, I didn't drop my crude hammer back there. I got, why do I got two of them? Oh, we're just going to drop this driftwood. I really don't like the driftwood anyway. It looks kind of crappy. Alright, give me my hatchet back, damn it. Alright, let's go. Alright, now we now we I guess we got to go further away. So we're going to need to go around this island and go that What, what are you doing? Oh my god, I, you're a crappy boat, man. I know I'm not the world's greatest engineer of boats. Really? Okay, you know what? Just get, get on the boat. Get on the boat. Oh my god, man. You're frustrating me. Alright, so I guess we're going to go around this island. Oh, it's so hard to turn. This thing cannot steer worth a crap. Oh, oh, oh. Dang it. So that's our island. I want to go further that way. I think I've been to both those islands, but we got to mark islands off. I hate to say this is going to probably be the most boringest episode ever. Can I just turn around this way, maybe? God, you suck so bad. You know what? I'm just going backwards. Screw this noise. Because you suck. Oh wow, yeah, he's kind of, he's coming after me, man. Coming at me, bro. 
Reverse engines forward. Oh, oh, bam. So we got these islands over here. So let's pop over to this one. I don't think I've been over this way. Turn, man, turn, turn. Oh my god. This is so hard, guys. So anyway, <laughs> my plan is to get some exploration down. Talk to you guys about the ideas I had and see what you guys think. I'm also mapping. I'm going to map this out. When I edit the video, I'm going to go back and, and map it out while I edit. So that way I know I'll have like a working map. I guess the positive thing about being at that back side of the map is we do know legitimately where I'm at. We, I mean, we have a point of reference instead of just assuming we're in the middle. So it'll be easier to map going forward because I can just put that on the very far side of the piece of paper. It'll work. It all works out in the end. So I'm kind of I'm disappointed in the islands, though, man. I'm so tempted. I'm, I'm going to look up more about the experimental branch and see what they offer as far as is it bigger islands at all or what. I know they have like the, the clay and the mortar and the brick and stuff. Or what is it? I guess you have mining. You can mine resources then now and stuff. You can make um, clay bricks and things. You can do, there's better building options than the crappy stuff we have. It's probably my biggest disappointment. So behind us is the first island that we set up base on. That's where we stranded to at first. I don't think I've been to this one. I legitimately don't think I have, but again, we're going to put the same thing we did. We'll find some sticks and put some sticks down or rocks or whatever. Bam! Boy, look at that. Coming in hot. <laughs> For real. Dude, I love it. Alright, let's first, let's just check it out. We're, I mean, we're going to take anything we can. There's a rock. Matter of fact, Lee, I need to put some stuff up so we have room to pick anything up. Did I really just drop you? All right, backpack. So I want to put, I'll put you guys in there. So we'll put you in there, and we'll put you. Uh, we'll leave it like it is. I'm sure I'll find more yuck on this planet. On this planet, <laughs> on this island. Yes, this is a strange, new, and wondrous planet. Yep, there's more yucca right there. So we'll do all this. I mean. Really, we're just focused on gathering resources and exploring a little bit right now. I think the next episode, I'm going to focus on getting stuff built, because we'll have plenty of resources, hopefully, by then. But I wanted to see where we were, and I, like I said, we kind of know now. It feels kind of bad. This is a crappy island, man. This is tiny. Could you imagine me stranded on an island like this size? You would be so bored. It's like, what would you do? I mean, what, what would you? how would you spend your time just... Blowing your damn thumbs. Oh, yay, another bucket. <laughs> Got more spuckets. Got some more tarp. Rock. Stick. Rock. Stick. Starfish. I'm not, yeah, there's really just nothing. Like, not nothing here to write home about, honestly. I mean, resource-wise, it's not even that great. Oh, there's some more. I do want the yucca, though. Yucca is, like, the best thing we could go for right now. And that's because we can just we need to make fiber and stuff. Everything takes fiber. Well, that's it. Oh. So where's our boat? So our boat's right there. So that's the island we came to. So we need to put a little directional thing down here. Oh God, again with this crap. I don't understand how... I know my hands are full, but I should be able to still... Oh, I picked that up. We want to get it like this. There we go. Perfect. Little one of these. Drop you? Oh no, that was bad. That's a little bit better. I kind of like this little positioning a little bit better. Is that a thing? That is a thing. Come down here and extend the old stick out. There we go. Look at that. Bam! That's our next island. Now, anything that I don't need, like these sticks right now, I'm just going to go ahead and pile up. So you got plenty of, of that stuff. Grab my axe. 
What time is it? So it's already 3.30. We might as well... You know, we're going to have to craft. I'm going to go ahead and craft a little structure here so we have a place to camp. You know, I'm also going to place this facing that way too, so I know. Now we need to craft up a fire. Oh, I need to make a fire. A fire starter kit. We need some fire, folks. Kindling. Can I make a fire pit? Actually get kind of fancy with it? I sure can. Bam. We got rocks around it, baby. Okay, I guess we're full up on that. Let's go and get this fire going. So, yeah. So, I think that's going to be it for today, guys. We've successfully navigated away from our island, and I am not lost. I know exactly how to get back to our base. This feels kind of good, at least. It'll take a while to get back, but I'm just going to keep pushing forward for right now. Get food as I need to. We're going to drop that there. Anything I can make, I will pretty much make on the fly. So, how are we doing on stats? Can I get where I can see my stats? There we go. Why was the why was my light not working? That's messed up. So we're okay right now. We could we could do some food. Which once it gets daylight, I'll get to take care of that. So, I think that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Man, look at that. Hold on. Let's crouch down for this. Oh, this is that's a beautiful view right there. Thumbnail. All right. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for hanging out and being part of this channel. Like I've always said, if you if you want to support the channel, just all you gotta do is watch the videos. Make sure you get your notifications turned on so you can get that content when I put it out. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want, slap a comment on there. Let me know if you guys want to keep seeing me kind of grind this out and progressively go through islands. Or if you want more abbreviated version of this where I'm just not, I'm showing, not showing as much of the grinding on camera. I don't mind doing that. I can spend time doing that. I kind of makes it easier. So, I, I don't know. I might go ahead and do that for the next video and, and wait to see what you guys say too. So, but if you, like I said, if you guys aren't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, man. I do daily videos at 9.30 on Mondays and Wednesdays and Fridays right now. I'm putting out a second video either at 12.30 or 3.30. I think it's going to be at 3.30 is when I'm going to plan on doing it more often. Um, the vlog when I wanted to get out there because of just what was going on. And I wanted to make, make sure everybody knew. So, anyway, guys, I've been Bloodstalker. This has been Stranded Deep, 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 Deep. <laughs> and as always... Peace out, y'all.